47, Diana here. Sorry that you've had so little luck at the mansion. It's really hard to tell where Vittorio was taken. We lost track of him in the airport. The agency does, however, feel that we fulfilled our end of the deal and expect you to comply with the terms by completing a minor assignment in St. Petersburg. Your objective is to take out an ex-KGB officer participating in a secret meeting, solely arranged so that you can take a clean shot at this officer. The meeting is taking place at 1300 hours today in the Pushkin building in Varozhnyt Square. The room is on the second floor in the west wing, overlooking the square. The windows are marked on the attached image. The building is the former FSB headquarters and can only be accessed from the square. There's one main entrance and a back entrance, both heavily guarded by FSB paramilitary personnel. The target must be eliminated during the meeting, which is scheduled to last five minutes. Absolutely nobody in the meeting room except the target must be harmed. This is very important, 47. Upon arrival by Metro, you will find your equipment and paraphernalia in locker 137 at the station. Your escape route is returning with the train. Avoid all contacts with soldiers and guards. They are instructed to remove any civilians from the area. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Hitman Silent Assassin Part 3. We are back doing St. Petersburg Square assassination, your generic assassination with sniper rifles. I will be doing a little bit of a history lesson as well while we are doing this. Without further ado, let's jump straight in. Uh, there is a video straight after this, but I'm not going to talk for very, very long. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for coming back for this LP, or welcome to the channel if you're just joining us for the first time. You will find a Hitman codename 47, uh, Let's Play Finished, and um, most of Metal Gear Solid Ground Zeroes. Uh, except the side missions that I haven't done yet. Without further ado, let's jump straight in and I will see you guys soon. St. Petersburg had seen Art. a share of bullets and betrayal yeah. over the years. Not an easy place for a comeback. I suspect both guards and soldiers here are well trained and highly suspicious of foreigners. I have to rely on the element of surprise. They don't expect me. And if I keep it cool, clean and quiet, they'll never know what hit them. Now, let's find locker number 137. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to St. Petersburg in the Russian Metro. Uh, just a quick bit of history for you on the Russian Metro as Metro, as I am um, versed in my Russian history, weirdly enough, I know it's not the general thing you'd find from the 16-year-old, but what I do know is that the Russian Metro was built to withstand a nuclear holocaust, because at the time, the Russians were pretty scared of what was coming at them. Um, but what you need to remember, uh, that it wasn't built in the Cold War, it was opened. Opened in 1935 um very big day momentous day for the russians um so yeah um if you need more history lessons please do ask as i am versed in russian and german history from about 1910 up to what's happening today 47. Enough. officers are arriving at the building looks like the meeting is starting ahead of schedule be uh, ready, these guards are not in the right patrol route, so we are going to have to wait until they are in the right patrol route. As if I took the sniper rifle right out right now, we would most likely be caught. So let's not take the sniper rifle out, out right now, and we will be fine. So, just a quick update for the channel, uh, I am recording Metal Gear Solid Ground Zero's side ops as we speak, and um, they will be coming soon. Um, we will also have Splinter Shell starting to record very, very soon. Uh, today, actually, it is it's going to be, so you can expect that in the near future. Nah, I don't really have much else to say, if I'm honest. So, yeah. I'm just going to wait until these guards are in the right place. I'm not sure where he's going. I can't take out the sniper rifle. I'm pretty sure that I am safe. Oh, 
Ooh. That was pretty close. Um, sorry about that. Don't do what I did. Just wait until, probably just wait. You see up here, uh, by those pillars, wait until guards are not walking in that direction. And you should be fine. With any luck, these guards will sort themselves out. With any luck, we will actually get to do this mission. But as a quick point, I may jump until they're in the right place. But once they are both walking in the same direction, uh, we will be able to go. There's one more one way to assassinate this guy. It's just I prefer this way as it's the most generic and it's actually the easiest to get silent assassin on. So just remember that. Just find the other the other soldier. He should be around here somewhere. He's actually disappeared. I would love to go right now, so you know what, I'm going to go now. There he is. Just be very careful here. We've waited long enough, we don't need to screw it up now. Sorry about the wait there. Um, usually that doesn't happen. Uh, first time I did this to figure it out. Um, they were in the perfect position, and I didn't have to wait that long, but, you know, we got to have a little talk about things, so, yeah. I suppose that's good. Now we just have to wait for this guard so I know where he is. He could be on the left, he could be on the right. If he's on the right, nope, there he goes. So when you see the guard walking to the right, you want to follow him down the stairs. And once you do that, you want to move directly to the right hand side of the wall and through the door shut the door on your way through and run over and pick this lock and the lock is picked so now you want to run through the sewers quite a long uh, tedious mission but once you have the timings down it's pretty easy um, I'm pretty sure I got Silent Assassin, I didn't actually go all the way to the end, so I don't know like, if there's an ending cutscene or anything. So that'll be a bit of a surprise. Um, all I did is when I went up, I shot the guy, I went down and went back through the surge, and then just before I got back on the metro, uh, I cancelled it and I restarted the mission, and here we are. So we want to climb up this ladder, but you don't want to go all the way up, because you need to know where the guards are, obviously. Sorry if I'm talking a bit fast, I'm just uh, thinking about a few things. Just need to wait until I'm high enough. Yep. Oh, be careful. Uh, best thing to do now is to drop the weapon. That guard shouldn't have been there, but uh, because of the big long thing, and to do with timing, he was there. Just don't stop moving, just keep on walking like you were him. Just go back and pick up the sniper rifle once he is in the correct position. There we go. Remember you don't want to run when you're in disguise because they will know something is up. We have now got the perfect timing just to walk across the street, so run straight up to this wall and then start walking once you hit this point. 47, the meeting will begin in five minutes. This reminds me about something that I didn't do last time. Ah, uh, it's the subtitles, which are enabled, so I don't know why that didn't come up. The meeting will start in five minutes. Um, but we are good. We can just continue. We know where all the guards are. Uh, just keep an eye on your top left hand corner with the exclamation mark. And you should be fine. <coughs> Pardon me. Patient, you probably should risk that. 
So as you can see, the building we're looking at the is where begin we in need four to be. Minutes, get ready. Now he is not in the opportune moment place that we need him to be. If I am not mistaken, uh, he will turn around. I'm pretty sure he will turn around. If he doesn't, just keep on walking. Now remember, you need to keep the sniper rifle out of sight, really. It's not standard issue for these guys. So they will know something is up. This is turning into about 100 times longer than when I first did it. Because these guards are just not in the right position for me. This is a really good good thing because we do need to get around. Oh crap, he's coming over, we need to move. Yeah, he's coming over. Just drop the weapon. And keep on walking. 47, the meeting will begin in two minutes. You're running out of time, 47. We need to run. So you run around this corridor, you go to the right, and then you run up to the very, very top. Uh, if that happens to you, just do what I did, drop the uh, sniper rifle. We're starting to get into blind territory here. And we are here. Perfect. Diana, it appears that a total of four generals have joined the meeting. I need extra information to pinpoint my target. That sounds strange, 47, and unexpected. Here's what I've got. The target is about 60 years old, a general in uniform. Do not execute until you have an absolute positive ID on the target, 47. I'll check the files for more detailed info. Be one back one with you in floor. a sec. Stay tuned. Meant to be one floor down, but that's fine. I've still got the target in my sight. I know which one he is. 47, here is we go. This one. I'm leafing through some private footage from last year. Hang on, 47. Looks like he's right-handed. That narrows it down, but still no positive he is ID. Drinking. My time slot is slipping. Any additional info? 47, I have Green. a feed from the database regarding his medical profile. Green. Apparently, he drinks a lot. Red. Okay. It's close, but still no 100% ID. Red. Hold on, 47. I've got his personal file Green. right here with a recent photo. 47, he's bald. Red. Green. 47, it appears he's a non-smoker. Yellow. Yellow. Green. I have visible contact and positive ID. I'm on the wrong floor. I should have been one floor down. We are now in blind territory, ladies and gentlemen. So we just gotta relax. Make sure I am clear. I should have been in that room there, I think. Or this room. I really can't remember. I will put it in the description once I do remember which room you're meant to be in. For now, you're just going to have to go to the top floor until I figure out. I will do this mission again and tell you which floor we should be on.
why I'm being so quiet, I'm just concentrating. This has been quite a hard mission. Uh, I was saying it was easy, but I lied, apparently. Um, I did not have my timings right. Uh, the first time I did this mission was very, very easy for me. I had all the timings perfectly created. Then I quit off, then I restart the mission, and all the patrols have changed, as you just saw. So even though that happened, we were okay, we still knew what we were doing. And we still killed our guy. The question is, is did we do it in Silent Assassin? And if not, you won't even see this recording. Because I will just re-record it and do it again and again and again until I get Silent Assassin on every single mission that I do. I'm gonna run a little bit. It takes quite a long time, but I'm just getting a little bit impatient. It's not something you should be doing when you're trying to stealth it. But this isn't your general type of stealth. I was thinking about this last night, if I'm honest. Snake and Sam Fisher wear skin tight clothing because it doesn't rustle, unlike Hit 47, who is a hitman, not an assassin. Well, not a stealth operative. He is an assassin. But. Yeah, he isn't the type of. Assassin that you would expect Fisher or someone to be. Uh, Fisher and all would plan it to the very, very bone. While 47 just sort of improvises, he's given a target, he goes and finds him and he kills him. Uh, as in Hitman games, you can have a shootout with all the guards. Not the way I like to do it, though, as you guys know. Just gonna do a little jogging backwards. Now for the tricky bit getting my clothes back. See if I can get on this ladder. Ugh, ladders. I'm never really good at them. They always get me screwed. We are back in the sewers. We are almost clear. Ah, oh, let's just try and not ruin it now. Because it's been quite long actually. Um, I can't check exactly how long. Hold on. 23 minutes so far. Um, excluding cutscenes and obviously all of that sort of stuff. Ooh. I'm starting to taste the freedom, but I don't want to screw up now, so let's look for a keyhole. And he is in the perfect place. Okay, maybe he is. There was another guard that had come. That is fine, just keep walking, you should be fine. He shouldn't really suspect you for being in a metro station. As it is open to the public, and somebody just came and saw me. Who was it? Obviously there's probably a way to get the sniper rifle home again. If you decide to go blasting through and... Yeah, I could probably do it that way to get it home, but I'm not going to. I am a professional. I will not play this game any other way than the way I see fit, which is 100% stealth and 100% non-lethal to anyone that doesn't need to be killed, because they are not my target and I am a disciplined soldier. At 16 years old. Ladies and gentlemen, let's find out if we've got this silent assassin. And we have, so there we go. Hmm. Um, let me just check something and I will be straight back after this short break. Okay, so I just went and did some research. I don't think it's possible to get 100% uh, stealth on this mission because we do. That is the easiest way to take that guy out without any suppressed weapons. And that alert is mandatory. So I am happy with that. 
Um, it wasn't bad on any account. So yeah, uh, thank you so much for watching, ladies and gentlemen, and I will see you guys next time. Peace out.